Welcome to our next tutorial of Mesh to Surface for SOLIDWORKS. Let's bring in just a simple mesh into SOLIDWORKS using the import mesh command. We'll just use the default settings and we'll get the object in our scene. So what we have is what is called duplicate a mesh. You just right click on the mesh that you selected and then you locate the command which is called duplicate mesh. It has two options. You can either duplicate all the visible triangles of this mesh or you can duplicate only the selected ones. If I just press the all visible, it will create simply another instance of the same mesh. This is very simple, but I'll show you uh, what it's useful for. Now I have the same identical copies and I can rename this and make it original. And, for example, here I want to decimate this down to 30%. This is useful that you can just hide your original mesh, you can keep it in your file for, fut for the future, but at the same time you can just use with the uh, mesh which is with the um, much lower number of uh, triangles. So this is one of the examples of the use. Another example, I will just um, rename this with the F2, F2 and we'll make it decimated. I will just right click and hide the whole mesh and we'll keep this visible on the screen. So now I have my original mesh. Let's go and make some selection. The whole idea is that if you have a huge part, you may want to just capture um, part of the mesh just partially and use this and focus on your work. And for example here, I will just use my lasso command to make sure that uh, select through is on and we'll just um, select this part. As the selection is now available, I can right click on my mesh then I will say duplicate selected only. So what happened is that there is a new mesh feature created in the feature tree which is has only the selected triangles. Let's see this. I will right click on the original and hide the mesh. So this is my partial mesh here that has less number of triangles. You can probably apply, apply different operation on this part only, etc. For example, let's hide this, bring in the original mesh. Again, I will just go to the mesh selection, will unselect everything and probably I can just select the other area of the um, my object but let's play with the last with the one selection for example I only need this top area press OK right click select duplicate mesh and then you pick the selected I can just hide my original mesh and you can focus to work on this mesh only you can save this on the file everything will be stored for the future and this is how you can use it. thank you for watching